next we move on to protozoan diseases protozoans live as parasite within the human body and cause diseases amebiosis african sleeping sickness and malaria or some of the protozoan diseases we will discuss malaria today malaria is caused by different types of plasmodium species such as plasmodium vivax plasmodium ovale plasmodium malariae and plasmodium falciparum plasmodium lives in the rbc of human in its mature condition and it is called as trophozoite it is transmitted from one person to another by the bite of infected female anopheles mosquito if you see the life cycle of plasmodium plasmodium vivax is a digenic parasite that means it involves two host man as the secondary host and female anopheles mosquito as the primary host the life cycle of plasmodium involves three phases namely cytogony gamogony and sporogony the parasite first enters the human blood stream through the bite of an infected female anopheles mosquito as it feeds the mosquito injects the saliva containing the sporozoites the sporozoites within the blood stream immediately enters the hepatic cells of the liver further in the liver they undergo multiple asexual fission and produce merozoites being released from liver cells the merozoites penetrates the rbc inside the rbc the merozoites begins to develop as unicellular trophozoite the trophozoite grows in size and a central vacuole develops pushing them to one side of the cytoplasm and becomes the signet ring stage so cell ku la patana vacuole perusa agaga cytoplasm chinadagum so it looks like a ring so it is called as a signet ring stage the trophozoite nucleus then divides asexually to produce the cytoshont the cytoshont divides and produces mononucleated merozoite eventually the rbc lyses releasing the merozoites and hemozoin hemozoin is a toxic substance into the blood stream to infect other rbc lyses of red blood cells results in cycles of fever and other symptoms so in tenth standard itself you might have know about hemozoin hemozoin is a toxic substance uh, results in fever this erythrocytic cycle is a cyclic and uh, repeats itself approximately every 48 to 72 hours or longer depending on the species of plasmodium involved the sudden release of merozoites triggers an attack on the rbc the merozoites differentiate into macrogametocyte and microgametocyte when these are ingested by the mosquito they develop into male and female gametes respectively in the mosquito's gut the infected erythrocyte lies and male and female gametes fertilize to form a diploid zygote called ukinite the ukinite migrates to the mosquito gut wall and develop into an oocyte the oocyte undergoes meiosis by the process called sporogony to form sporozoites these sporozoites migrate to the salivary gland of the mosquito the cycle is now completed and when the mosquito bites another human host the sporozoites are injected and the cycle begins a new so that's all about the life cycle of plasmodium so it includes two host you already know that the early symptoms of malaria are headache nausea and muscular pain so uh, due to this hemozoin in the blood it causes shivering chills high fever followed by sweating fever and chills are caused partly by the malarial toxins and they induce macrophages to release uh, tnf alpha and interleukin tnf means uh, tumor necrosis factor what are the different types of malaria there are different types of malaria 
Tertine benign tertine or vivax malaria which is caused by plasmodium vivax. Quartan malaria caused by plasmodium malariae. Mild tertine malaria caused by plasmodium ovale and malignant malaria caused by plasmodium falciparum. How you can prevent this uh, malaria? It is possible to break the transmission cycle by killing the insect vector, that means the mosquito. Mosquitoes lay the egg in water. The larvae hatch and develop in water but breathe air by moving to the surface. Oil can be sprayed over the water surface to make it impossible for mosquito larvae and pupae to breathe. So, mosquito on the water la eggs lay upon no, the larva na upon no, air kaga kandipa surface of the water kuvaro. Number oil spray panito abdina, the la na panamudi, the respire panamudi adi. Okay, and then another method is uh, ponds, drainage ditches, and other permanent bodies of water can be stocked with fishes such as Gambusia, which feed on mosquito larvae. So, this type of uh, is called as uh, biological control. Bi that means uh, to kill the other species, we will use one, uh, other species of animal. So, we use Gambusia fish to kill the larvae of the mosquito. Okay, preparations containing bacillus thuringinus can be sprayed to kill the mosquito larvae since it is not toxic to other forms of uh, life. The best protection against malaria is to avoid being bitten by mosquito. People are advised to use mosquito nets, wire gouging of windows and doors to prevent the mosquito bite. Next, we move on to adolescence, drug and alcohol abuse. Adolescence begins with a period of rapid physical and sexual development called puberty to maturity at 12 to 19 years of age. Adolescence is also a highly dynamic period of psychological and social changes in individuals. Adolescents are vulnerable to group pressure and many youngsters are pushed into experimenting with drugs and alcohol. Proper education and guidance would enable youth to say no to drugs and alcohol and to follow a healthy lifestyle. Alcohol is a psychoactive drug which acts on the brain affecting the person's mind and behavior. It is a depressant which slows down the activity of nervous system. The intake of certain drugs for a purpose other than their normal clinical use in an amount and frequency that impair one's physical, physiological and psychological function is called drug abuse. Drug abuse na normal clinical use pandratakku mele namalodaya physical, physiological, psychological functions affect panichna that is called drug abuse. The drug which are commonly abused include opioids, cannabinoids, cocoa alkaloids, barbiturates, amphetamines and LSD. Opioids Opioids are drug which bind to specific opioid receptor present in the central nervous system and intestinal tract. Heroin is chemically diacetyl morphine which is white, colorless and bitter crystalline compound. So, uh, heroin red or a uh, well powder marirka kudia or bodai pearl. It is uh, obtained by acetylization of morphine, which is extracted from the flowers of poppy plant. Poppy plant landana, the opium erikranga. Morphine is one of the strongest painkiller and is used during surgery. It is the most widely abused necrotic drug which acts as a depressant and slows down body functions. Next is cannabinoids. Cannabinoids are a group of chemicals obtained from cannabinus sativa, the Indian hemp plant. Natural cannabinoids are the main source of marijuana and ganja. Marijuana is nothing but uh, it is a uh, drug. So it interferes the transport of uh, neurotransmitter, dopamine and has a uh, Potent stimulating action on the central nervous system 
producing increased energy and sense of euphoria. Euphoria means ஒரு மாதிரியான மயக்கமான சூழ்நிலை அதில் ஒரு சந்தோஷம் அவங்களுக்கு அதுதான் யூஃபோரியா நெக்ஸ்ட் இஸ் கொக்காயின் கொக்காயின் இஸ் அ ஒயிட் பவுடர் தட் இஸ் ஒப்டைன் ஃப்ரம் த லீவ்ஸ் ஆஃப் கொக்கோ பிளான்ட் கொக்காயின் இஸ் அ ஒயிட் பவுடர் தட் இஸ் ஒப்டைன் ஃப்ரம் த லீவ்ஸ் ஆஃப் கொக்கோ பிளான்ட் இட் இஸ் காமன்லி கால்ட் அஸ் கோக் கொக்காயின் காஸ் சீரியஸ் ஃபிசிக்கல் அண்ட் ஃபிசியாலஜிக்கல் சைக்கலாஜிக்கல் ப்ராப்ளம்ஸ் இன்க்ளூடிங் ஹாலிசினேஷன் அண்ட் பேரோனியா the other plants with hallucinogenic properties are ateropa belladonna and datura so tobacco tobacco is smoked chewed and used as a snuff so tobacco pugai illai smoke pandrom chew pandrom sila samayam adha kaiye apdi thechittu adu smell pannuvaanga illaya so andha maadhiri use pandrom so it increases the carbon monoxide content of the blood and reduces the concentration of heme bound oxygen ஆக்சுவலி நம்ம ஹீமோக்ளோபின் இட் கேரிஸ் ஆக்சிஜன் ஓகே ஸோ தட் காசிங் ஆக்சிஜன் டெஃபிஷியன்சி இன் த பிளட் டொபாக்கோ கண்டைன்ஸ் நிகோட்டின் கார்பன் மோனாக்சைட் அண்ட் தார்ஸ் விச் காஸ் ப்ராப்ளம்ஸ் இன் த ஹார்ட் லங் அண்ட் நர்வஸ் சிஸ்டம் அட்ரினல் கிளான்ஸ் ஆர் ஸ்டிமுலேட்டட் பை நிகோட்டின் டு ரிலீஸ் அட்ரினலின் அண்ட் நார் அட்ரினலின் விச் இன்க்ரீசஸ் பிளட் ப்ரெஷர் அண்ட் ஹார்ட் பீட் அடிக்ஷன் அண்ட் dependence mean by addiction addiction is a physical or psychological need to do or take or use certain substance such as alcohol to the point where it could be harmful to the individual this addictive behavior can be personally destructive to a person over time addicts start to lose not only their jobs homes and money but also friendship family relationship and contact with the normal world repeated use of uh, drugs and alcohol affect the tolerance level of the receptors present in the body these receptors then respond only to the highest doses of drugs and alcohol leading to greater intake and addiction தொடர்ந்து ஒரு ட்ரக்ஸை யூஸ் பண்ணால் அல்கஹால் சாப்பிட்டா அவங்களுடைய டாலரன்ஸ் லெவல் பார்த்தோன்னா ரிசப்டாரில் இருக்கும் இல்லையா அது அதிகமாகிடும் அதுக்கப்புறம் கம்மியாக சாப்பிட்டா கூட அவங்களுக்கு அந்த இது ஆகுது அதிகமாக தான் சாப்பிட்டுக்கிட்டே இருக்கிற அளவுக்கு வந்துடும் எக்ஸசிவ் யூஸ் ஆஃப் ட்ரக் அண்ட் ஆல்கஹால் லீட் டு ஃபிசிக்கல் அண்ட் சைக்கலாஜிக்கல் டிபெண்டன்ஸ் ஃபிசிக்கல் டிபெண்டன்ஸ் இஸ் அ ஸ்டேட் இன் விச் த யூசஸ் பாடி ரெக்வயர்ஸ் அ கண்டினியூஸ் ப்ரெசன்ஸ் ஆஃப் த ட்ரக் If the intake of the drug or alcohol is abruptly stopped, he or she would develop withdrawal symptoms. If you have to drink and drink, you will have to drink and drink and drink withdrawal symptoms. You will know that you will have to drink and drink and drink and drink and drink and drink and restlessness. Okay, wow. The withdrawal symptoms may range from mild tremors to convulsions, severe agitations and fits, depressed mood, anxiety nervousness restlessness irritability insomnia insomnia means thukam illama irukirathu dryness of throat etc depending on the type of drug abuse also what are the effects of uh, drug and alcohol there are two types of effects long term effect and short term effect short term effect appear only for a few minutes after the intake of drugs and alcohol the abuser feels a false sense of well-being and a pleasant drowsiness some short term effects are euphoria pain dullness of senses alteration in behavior blood pressure necrosis that means deep sleep nausea and vomiting drugs and alcohol have long term effect that leads to serious damages because of the constant and excessive use of the drugs the physical and the mental disturbance makes the life of the user unbearable and torturous for example heavy drinking permanently damages the liver and brain what is liver cirrhosis liver cirrhosis is nothing but scarring of liver is called as liver cirrhosis 
over time fat accumulation and high levels of alcohol destroy the liver cells and the scar tissue grows in the place of dead cells this scarring of a liver is called as liver cirrhosis alcohol irritates the stomach lining due to the production of excess acid leading to ulcers excessive alcohol weakens the heart muscle causing the scar tissue to build up in the cardiac muscle fibers as a result heavy drinkers have an increased risk of high blood pressure stroke coronary artery disease and even heart attack there is a syndrome called Korsakoff syndrome a chronic memory disorder is uh, most commonly caused by this alcohol misuse saadharama kudichavanga night pesna pagalla varandruvanga adu martha idu so chronic memory disorder that is called as a korsakoff syndrome so how we can prevent and control this so it is practically possible to prevent uh, someone from using this drugs and alcohol first we have to effectively dealing with the peer pressure effectively dealing with peer pressure the biggest reason for this teens to start on drugs is due to their friends or peer groups imposing pressure on them or thavan alla irukka koodadu odane kooda irukra friend avana edavadhu kettu vittruvan adukku than nalla friends ah kooda vechikano hence it is important to have a better group of friends to avoid such harmful drugs and alcohol seeking help from parents and peers second one seeking help from parents and peers so help from parents and peer group should be sought out immediately so that they can be guided appropriately help may even be sought from close or trusted friends getting proper advice to sort out their problems would help the young to vent their feelings of anxiety and guilt sir samaya ara tappu pannirpa or nalla friend enna pannuva avana thiruthuva nambikiyana trusted friend and close friend avan da enna pannuva thappu sedi thappu pannita marandidu vittidu apdi solli avana thiruthan okay or so namba parents node help eduthukonum avanga kudumba soolnala enna edu nu paakanum third one education and counseling education and counseling create positive attitude to deal with many problems and to accept disappointments in life counseling kudukonum avangalukku fourth one looking for danger signs teachers and parents need to look for sign that indicate tendency to go in for addiction so it's a duty of the teachers and parents to take care of the children whether he is addicted or not seeking professional and medical assistance so assistance is available in the form of highly qualified psychologists psychiatrists and the addiction and rehabilitation programs to help individual to overcome that problem so if you are rather rumbo and the matter addict i tang so to overcome that we have to get advice from the psychiatrist next is the mental health what is mental health mental health is a state of well being of the mind with the self esteem what is self esteem self esteem means liking yourself nambla nambleke pudikano and being able to stand up for what you believe is right நீ என்ன பண்ணுற நீ என்ன நினைக்கிறியோ அது கரெக்டுன்னு உனக்கு தெரியணும் பாசிட்டிவ் மென்டல் ஹெல்த் இஸ் அன் இம்பார்ட்டன்ட் பார்ட் ஆஃப் வெல்னஸ் அ மென்டலி ஹெல்த்தி பர்சன் ரிஃப்ளெக்ட்ஸ் குட் பர்சனாலிட்டி ஆக்டிவிட்டீஸ் ஆஃப் மென்டலி ஹெல்த்தி பீப்புள் ஆர் ஆல்வேஸ் அப்ரிஷியேட்டட் அண்ட் ரிவார்டட் பை திஸ் சொசைட்டி மென்டல் ஹெல்த் இம்ப்ரூவ்ஸ் த குவாலிட்டி ஆஃப் லைஃப் ஆல்வேஸ் வி ஷுட் ஹாவ் அ பாசிட்டிவ் மென்டல் ஹெல்த் டிப்ரெஷன் depression is a common mental disorder that causes people to experience depressed mood loss of interest or pleasure feelings of guilt or low self worth disturbed sleep poor appetite low energy and poor concentration so for depression depression in the vartha recent ah the corona vandadilirund depression 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 so depression rendu or mental disorder idanal nammude mood abbe or mari edho or viraktiyana soonala low interest padin sonna padikireengala padikka matringa so low interest in or pleasure feelings of guilt edhaadhu thappu pannitom abindra or kutra unarchi disturbed sleep thoongaradhu kadaiyad night 3 mani varaikka message for appetite seriya saapradilla low energy and poor concentration so this all causes depression 
So what are the signs and symptoms of mental depression? Loss of self-confidence and self-esteem. When you have self-confidence, you will have mental depression. Anxiety, by not being able to enjoy things that are usually pleasurable or interesting. All of us are happy. We have a mood of mood of air. So lifestyle changes like exercise, meditation, yoga and healthy habits, food habits can help to be relieved from depression. So depression is not going to be able to exercise, to do yoga, to do all the things. Exercise stimulates the body to produce serotonin and endorphins which are the neurotransmitters that suppresses the depression. Exercise is not going to be able to do all the things. Serotonin and endorphins are not going to be practice uh, exercise in daily life creates a positive attitude participating in exercise programs can increase self esteem can boost self confidence create a sense of empowerment enhance social connections and uh, relationships lifestyle disorders in human beings there is a old saying called health is wealth okay with the changes in lifestyle there are many emerging medical conditions and diseases that are reducing human longevity ipp irukra condition ku ooru patta noye ella varudhu lifestyle disorders result due to activities involving smoking alcohol and drug abuse consuming high fat diet lack of exercise or even living a latent life the following facts will help in better understanding of the lifestyle disorders lifestyle disorder causes cardiovascular diseases எக்ஸசைஸ் பண்ணால் ஹார்ட்டுக்கெலாம் ரொம்ப நல்லது இல்லையா பல்மனரி அண்ட் கார்டியாக் இதெல்லாம் நல்லா வேலை செய்யும் ஸோ லைஃப் ஸ்டைல் டிசார்டர் காசஸ் கார்டியோவாஸ்குலர் டிசீஸ் ரிசல்ட்டிங் இன் தேர்ட்டி ஒன் பர்சன்டேஜ் ஆஃப் குளோபல் டெத் மோஸ்ட்லி எதாவது நல்லா தான் இருந்தார் திடீர்னு இறந்துட்டார் காரணம் என்ன ஹார்ட் அட்டாக் நெக்ஸ்ட் ஒன் தி செடன்ட்ரி லைஃப் ஸ்டைல் ஆல்சோ காசஸ் டெஃபிஷியன்சி ஆஃப் விட்டமின் சஜ் எஸ் விட்டமின் டி ரிசல்ட்டிங் இன் ஃபெட்டிக்னஸ் டயர்ட்னஸ் பேக் பெயின் டிப்ரெஷன் போன் லாஸ் மசில் பெயின் எக்ஸெட்ரா Lifestyle disorders also includes social isolation resulting in age related problems. So eating junk foods that have high calorie value rich in carbohydrates and fat can be lead to obesity and early health issues. Junk foods adhigama saapradha nala obesity varum. Consumption of processed and packed food which lack in fiber may result in constipation. Constipation malachikkal and the mari white valley. Idalla varum. So, processed food, packed food, it is not going to be fiber content. We have to take fruits, vegetables and greens. Several people today complain of irritable bowel syndrome with stomach discomfort. So, if you say, it's a virus, it's a virus, it's a virus, it's a virus, it's a problem, it's a virus, it's a virus, it's a virus, it's a virus. The main cause of this irritable bowel syndrome is stress and other illness. So, if you have stress, you can't get stressed. வயிறுலாம் மத மதம் இருக்க மாதிரி இருக்கும் அது ஒரு மாதிரி வலி இருக்கும் இதெல்லாம் இருந்துச்சுன்னா ஸ்ட்ரெஸ்ஸு அதுக்கு ஒரு முக்கிய காரணம் நெக்ஸ்ட் ஹவு வி கேன் மோடிஃபை அவர் லைஃப் ஸ்டைல் அவாய்ட் ஈட்டிங் ஜங்க் ஃபுட்ஸ் அண்ட் ஃபுட்ஸ் தட் ஹவ் ப்ரிசர்வேட்டிவ்ஸ் அண்ட் கலரிங் ஏஜென்ட்ஸ் ஃபிசிக்கல் எக்ஸசைசஸ் சச் அஸ் பிரிஸ்க் வாக்கிங் அண்ட் யோகா கேன் பி டன் ரெகுலர்லி ஃபாலோயிங் மெடிக்கல் அட்வைஸ் இஃப் எனி ஹெல்த் ப்ராப்ளம்ஸ் இன் அடிஷன் டு லைஃப் ஸ்டைல் டிசார்டர்ஸ் so to avoid uh, smoking drugs and drinking alcohol follow a healthy balanced diet rich in vitamins and proteins sleep 7 to 8 hours every day is required so these are some of the modifications that we have to do to uh, enrich our uh, body so that's all uh, we finished uh, this uh, seventh lesson okay so it's a very important lesson and uh, you have to uh, study all the signs and symptoms of mental depressions idellame ungulukana lesson so you have to read you have to understand the concept okay thank you